Time now for sports with Dom Tibbetts. MSU's new men's basketball coach Danny Sprinkle had his opening press conference today and our Brooke Leonard was at MSU. Danny Sprinkle was officially introduced today as the next men's head basketball coach and while the fans took to the news pretty well, athletic director Leon Costello might be the happiest to have a Bobcat legend back in Bozeman. Bringing Danny back to Montana State reminds us of our great former players and coaches and it gives us the bold challenge to return this program to greatness. Bobcat fans, it is my pleasure to introduce the 23rd men's basketball coach at Montana State, Mr. Danny Sprinkle. Yeah. Part of this is bringing the energy back into, into the field house, which Danny talked about, and uh, seeing the reaction here today gives us a lot of hope that that can happen. And the idea of bringing former Bobcats back to campus has been a trend since Costello arrived. Look at Kane Ione and Bobby Daly with the football program and Sprinkle was a no-brainer to lead the program he once played for. And so when you can combine basketball with a uh, student-athlete experience that we have and really preparing the student-athletes for life, he fit the mold. And when Sprinkle finally got to the mic, emotions definitely ran high as tears filled his eyes while he thanked each and every person who got him to where he is today, a goal he always had. One of our managers at Northridge my first couple years just reminded me last night. Uh, he texted me and just said, I'm so proud of you. Like, I remember going into your office and seeing your goals above your desk. And the top goal was to be a head coach. But back then it was to be a head coach by the age of 30. That obviously didn't happen. Um, but this took me a little longer, but I got there. And, but I think that's important because it was just, I always had it in the back of my mind. And I always knew kind of in my heart that it would be here. One of Sprinkle's goals is to hopefully be cutting down a net in at least five years. And he wants to use some Montana talent to get that done. You know, you got you to find the right guys and you got to develop them. Um, but I think there's, Montana kids are hungry. You know, they're, they're culture kids. They, they love the state. They love to come play at Montana State University. I want kids that want to come to Montana State University for the academics and just to be here because they love it. Sprinkle said the first change he wants to make is start by meeting with players and the staff to kind of figure out what direction he wants the program to go before the summer. And reporting in Bozeman, Brooke Leonard, MTN Sports.